Here's round one of this 10 round heavyweight bout. George Foreman on the left in the red trunks, if you're watching in color. George Chavallo in the blue trunks with the red border. Arthur McCanty, the referee. They're wearing eight ounce gloves. The count will continue at the bell if a man is floored. He must take a mandatory eight count. And if a man is floored and three times in a round, he is considered knocked out. Now, it's going to be very hard for Chevalo to stay away from that hard left jab, and it is a hard left jab that Foreman has. It just got in there. And again. Chevalo's best is his left hook, and he got that in twice to the body. And McCaddy is telling the boys not to get too rough. Imagine that. Both are very strong. It isn't often you see Chevalo using a left jab. Maybe they taught him something. Chavalo figures to go to the body to slow down the younger opponent. 11 years younger at 21. Foreman to make use of that left jab. A minute to go in round one. Foreman is keeping Chavalo off balance. Chavalo can't get set here. A uh, good right hand by Chavalo. And those are pretty good bombs. 10 seconds to go in round one. <laughs> round two in Madison Square Garden. The first round was a big one for Foreman. Chevala must hope that he'll punch himself out. Foreman making good use of his reach advantage. He's giving Chevalo no rest. Chavala apparently having trouble with his breathing. Two minutes left in this round. Chavalo's best punch is his left hook to the body, and the question is, can he get it in there often enough? A good one to the head by Chavalo. Chavalo a little bit puffy around the left eye.
There you can see the puffiness around Chevalo's eyes. A minute to go in this round. Time has to be on Chevalo's side. The first two rounds aren't. That is an angry mouse under the left eye of Chevalo. Ten seconds to go in round two. Round three at Madison Square Garden. George Foreman in the red trunk. George Chevallo in the blue trunk. Foreman's the taller of the two by about three inches. Foreman, for all of his inexperience, he's only had 21 fights, all of which he's won, is going about this job in a methodical, workmanlike way. And he's taking his time, unhurried, just piling up the points. Chevallo <laughs> staggered. Chevallo has never been off his feet. Two minutes left in the round. It's an awesome battering that Chevallo is taking. He is now spitting blood. Chevallo being battered in his own corner. And Irving Ungerman, his manager, is asking the referee to stop it. He's climbing into the ring. The referee hasn't heard him. It's all over. It's all over. Arthur McCanty has stopped the fight. A devastating third-round knockout for George Foreman, a young man destined to become heavyweight champion of the world.